Time. 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 No! Huh? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Dark, uh... Oh, shit. Hello, hello, everyone, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, the Telltale series. Uh, we are now on episode two of the first season. Um, the last one I split up into two episodes because I ran out of time for the whole thing, which, in hindsight, I should have just kept recording because it was only an extra, like, 40 minutes, but oh, well. It's fine. Um, what happened last episode? We saved Kenny's son. We saved, uh, the lady instead of the dude, the smart dude, because she had a gun, but they both, in uh, she he ended up dying anyway, so, oh well. Um, we got punched in the face because, uh, she knows that, no, it's not her, it's the other girl, the girl with the gun. She, uh, she knows that we're a cr uh, criminal, same with her, uh, this lady's dad. Um, she... Uh, he knows that we're a criminal who murdered someone who slept with our ex slept with our wife. Which is perfectly fine, which is understandable. Um, so yeah, let's, let's get into it, shall we? Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Previously on The Walking Dead. Oh, it's gonna give us a previously. Okay, I didn't know. I know that. who you are. Oh, I Watch got another out. good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Oh, my God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Yeah, yeah. Basically, just showing off all the uh, stuff that happened. It is crazy. <clears throat> this game adapts to your choices. Thank you. I know. I'm very much aware. Three months later, holy shit. That's a long time. Look at me. My legs all healed up. Who fucks this? Damn it. Dickhead. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I hmm. still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Hmm. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. Mark? We're all hungry. Who the no fuck's kidding. Mark? Who the hell is Mark? When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Hmm. Not, Not enough. enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. You mean Lily's lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal chance of missing a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Hmm. Look out for he better. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. It's because I was a criminal. I murdered someone. Ha ha ha. 
thinks I'm dangerous. He's an old racist bastard looking out for his daughter. He thinks I'm a danger to the group and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. Mm. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <laughs> he did, because he, he didn't like me. He didn't want me going with him. But I got saved by Kenny, because Kenny's my friend. We love Kenny. Kenny's a good lad. He's gonna shoot a bird. That is a noise. Don't. Gunshot will bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Oh. Ah! Oh shit. Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Elf back. Okay, I'm ready for Q and E's. I'm ready for anything. My left arm is twitching. Uh oh. That does not sound good, my friend. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. Huh? What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, but just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Can't chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, this is fucked up. We've gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. <laughs> Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, uh -oh. please, hurry. Uh oh. Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Uh oh. oh no. Time to cut off the Lego. Shit, walkers. It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Uh. Hell yeah, Please we're cutting off the leg. Lee, do something. I'm gonna have to cut you out. No, no, no. Try the trap again. And try to get the chains. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah! And one more for good measure, sir. Oh, yeah. oh god, it's still intact. Okay, uh, uh, fourth time lucky. Yeah, you're gonna need to get that treat, bro. Oh god! Shit! Is he? He passed out. Oh. He's missing the entire He's alive. Grab him and let's go. We need to bandage up his leg, bro. He's gonna bleed out before we get anywhere. Oh, there you go. Look, they put a thing around it. Kid, move. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on. We gotta move! Brother, you're an idiot. Oh, he did. No! Well, I didn't even get a fucking choice to save him. Kids an Id idiot being sick over in a corner where walkers are walking towards you. You know? I mean, even I wouldn't have made that mistake. Stupid. Ooh, episode two. Starved for help. Starved for help, sorry.
Ja. Ja. Clementine. Where did they get all these guns from, anyway? Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. Yeah, I don't mean he's gonna what make happened? it. Oh, what the What's going on? I don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What's up? What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here! What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking minute? What? No, no, I don't. Leave the other one I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We left the other one behind. Other one? Jesus, Lee. What if there are more of them? What if they followed you here? There wasn't anybody else. Just us. How do you know he's not lying? He's just a well, kid. Hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. Yeah, we got to stick together. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Oh. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to Aww. think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, oh. come on, you're being dramatic. Mm. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later, you're going to have to decide whose side you're on. I choose Kenny. Fuck I don't see woman. any of you stepping that. up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, but, uh, please. Shut the fuck up. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? I can't wait until he gets shot in the face, or you know, he gets bit. You think this is easy for me? No. Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. I'll do it. Everyone can hate you me. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Shit. Kids come first. That's why I say, kids come first. Four food items for hung ten hungry people. Ah, oh, fuck. Shit. Kids come first. I'm not giving the new dude food because, you know, he may have just lost his friend and someone else who's missing a leg. This one, this woman probably needs food because she's doing shit. Right now, I'm going to give the kids food, and if anyone wants to argue that, they can go fuck themselves. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Of course. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Right, uh... Give Clementine food. She's my priority. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Crackers and cheese. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> Obviously, I'm going to choose to I'll take care of Clementine. If you have any more food... Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? Okay, Duck. Take some hey, food. Doc. How about a little food? It's not much, but I will give you half an hey. apple. Oh, heck yes. Is there peanut butter? No. What do you think, Duck? 
No, probably <laughs> not. <laughs> okay, so we give these two food. Oh, fuck. Where I don't want to give the old man food. I don't want to give Kenny food. I don't really Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Well, fuck you. I'm giving this dude food. Actually, no. I better see Kenny first. Wait. See this shit. Might see Clementine's hat. It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. Carly, okay. We give Carly some food. She's been doing the bulk of the lookout. This is... Ooh, what's this? Sturdy, but it's not gonna hold up forever. Just like the rest of this place. Mm. Who's this? Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Of course. Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this. Sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Yeah, I'm aware. It's what your husband wanted. <sighs> Figures. I love that man to death, but I swear sometimes he's dumber than a bag of hammers. <laughs> well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. I uh, where's Kenny? I need to speak to Kenny, see what he thinks I should do with some of this food. I'll speak to her as well in a minute. Yo, Kenny, how you doing, bro? Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. Hell yeah. Coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Damn it. I should have probably told him to stay. Oh well. Uh, who's this? That's Kenny. Carly. But this bitch. We should talk about you and Kenny. I had to think about, about that. Us? The arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. Fuck. Keep an eye out. Fine. So I've got I got two pieces of food left. I'm gonna give this man. Here, you, you found the food. Open. You had the food to begin with. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Sure, go for it. Give Mark the axe. Give that. Uh, give Mark the axe. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry, give it a rest. I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Is that what you told him? Fuck. That's right. That's not what I meant. I never said that. That's not what I meant. Yeah, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? Oh, beat Look, your ass, bro. I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. I was going to actually give him some food, but fuck that cunt. His face. He's like, ugh. There's no... Oh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Yeah. Since you're the medic of the group, I'll give you food. Here you go. Here, eat something. <sighs> Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Oh. I need space, Lee. 
Okay, well, she ain't getting no fucking food then. Should I give it to the new dude? Oh, fuck. Can I give these two food? No. Uh, no, I don't want to give it to Kenny. Carly. Want something to eat? <laughs> Could you imagine she's like, do you want something to eat? And I just fucking leave. Like, now you're not in food. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. Oh. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Wow. I was just like... Uh, I have to give it to someone still? Oh, fine. Kenny. There's fucking food, bro. Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yep. Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. I was not you fed Kenny. Well, fuck's sake. Well, I chose the kids first, so... Not such an easy job, is it? Never said it was. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. No, definitely You're not. You're out! What happened to my food? Oh, for fuck's sake. There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Hey, I gave food to Mark. And the kids. And Kenny. <laughs> Admittedly, giving Ken, food to Kenny probably wasn't a good idea. Come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Oh, oh. Ken, come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? <laughs> oh my god! Ah, uh, wait! Ah, uh, who's paying attention? I forgot they changed. Oh shit. Fuck. Uh, uh. Again, again, oh my god, do it, give me the axe, oh fuck, fucking Mark, Mark, do something, S to back, oh shit, oh shit me, Don't shoot it! Oh my god. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. Mark? Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Hi, hi. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What?! Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. Huh. It's just when you die. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected? God help us. God help us. It makes sense. Those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides, everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills, a lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Huh? Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we 
We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Yeah. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Shit. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Thanks, Claire. So, uh, what Clara, do y'all think? Whatever your name is. No deal, we'll just stay here. Okay. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. Do we have gallons of gas? If so, where the fuck are we getting these gallons of gas and we have no food? We have gas but no fucking food, bro. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Oh, and the kid came it's with nice us too. to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Oh, no. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Keeps us motivated. Me as a leader. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Do they? Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Uh, Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. And Asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly mm. did happen with the senator? It was an accident. No, not the time. You know what happened. It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Mm. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. Thank I you. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I'm a convicted murderer. I grew up here. Murderham is my home now. I live around a lot. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in the... Who's running things over there? Let's not talk about it. Uh, uh... We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Nine including kids, enough to defend ourselves. Change shut. Nine including the kids. You forgot Ben. Me? That makes it ten. Well, we'd love to get you all <laughs> me? out to the dairy. Like, <laughs> like I said, we've got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Huh? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who are they? Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it all to yourself. Oh no, there's yeah, a Yeah, and you know what? More. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! Oh. Fuck oh. you! Oh. Fuck oh. you! Jesus! Holy shit. That was the world out here has gone to shit. Come on. Let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Can we not take his gun? He quite clearly had a gun. Could we not go and grab it? Loot his corpse for any like usable items? No. There. Well, at least I tried. Here it is. 
St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yeah, that is a lot. That's enough to literally electrocute you to death. Ever had any accidents? Is a brilliant setup. You don't have kids around here. Ever events. have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. Hello. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. Mm -hmm. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Uh, uh he's just focused on survival. Uh, Lily, she's tough as nails and keeps us focused on what it takes to survive. Lily was in the military, like me. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh yeah, um, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply for us as well? Gasoline, we're all really hungry. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Oh no. Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. Please It'll don't. be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Please Daddy, don't tell me they're cannibals. You come help me out in the kitchen? I have a real bad feeling about this, like they're cannibals or something. Why don't I the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Bye bye. Don't touch the electric fence. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm going to go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. Hi. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh, man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Make sure this place is, let's make sure this place we should do whatever we can to help out. They're offering us food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs some help securing the perimeter, then that's what we do. Hell yeah. We'll make them all friendly. As long as they're not cannibals, I'm happy. As you know, Walking Dead cannibals is a real thing. Ooh, what's that? Oh. What the fuck is this? Is that a swing? Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bet. Maybe, maybe I can try and fix it? Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks Sweet. like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Mmm. A rope. I got an axe. Need some wood. Oh my god, that is shit. Talk to this man's in it. Badger. Yeah. So Matt. what's your read on Andy so far? Think they'd be open to letting us stay? 
Security perimeter Getting will help. the perimeter secured is going to help us a lot. We'll be getting in good and making this place safer for us. I'm going to get back to it. Okay. So, ooh, what's this? You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? Trying to help out. I'm curious about your barn. Just trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Sounds good. Aye. Picket fence. Hmm. Boy. <laughs> That's all you got to say. Hey, wood. Could be useful if I can find some boards to cut. Looks like boards right next to you. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Sweet. <laughs> oh, you're just gonna store it in your back pocket, yeah? <laughs> Man, this fence is fantastic. We'll do whatever you want to help keep it running. Well, clearing that perimeter is going to be a big help. Just let me know when you're ready. Mm, I needed a rope. I don't see no rope. What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. Hey, uh, don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky, and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, add lights on. I assume I'm just looking at lights at this fucking point. Ooh, yes, we can do that. That's cool. Oh, not that one. That one's on. Let's fix that up. The board is good, but I need some rope. Hmm. Where are we gonna get some motherfucking rope? Maybe we come back later and get some. Oh. Oh, no, I don't wanna touch that because he's gonna get angry. Or maybe not angry, just like, what are you doing over there, bro? Oh, I'm like, oh, no, I'm sorry. Hi. 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 Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back in the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Yep. Been stockpiling, huh? Uh, no one fucks with us. Help protect the dairy. What else do you have? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Mm -hmm. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Like us? Mm. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Come, Mark. Let's check the north side. Or well, northwest, whatever he fucking said. I wasn't really paying attention. Ooh. Do you think we're doing enough to get the St. John's to like us? Well, we don't want to seem over anxious. Showing them we can handle this fence is going to go a long way. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. <laughs> What's up with you telling him what I said about him thinking I'm dangerous? Look, you said it. You even admitted it right to him. Uh, he's a piece of shit. We'll work out somehow. I try to be civil at I least. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. <laughs> oh, he's got an arrow There's in him. One. 
Oh shit. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. I was just making sure. Come on, let's push it off. Let's take the arrow. Disgusting. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Hmm. Push him off. Nice. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Well, you have to worry about gas. Unless we run out of gas, we need people to defend it. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Mm, which means they're delaying the inevitable which should take place if we have to know. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. Thanks, Mark. I There's like another you. one. I see it. Oh. Uh, should I kick it? Um. Man, the fence burned right into its hands. I think they fused together. I well, cut <laughs> Nice. Nice. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Who's gonna leave the hands there? Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but. It's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Focus on the task. Mongo too will go ask for some more. Tea Just to try to focus on the task. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Hmm. Oh, the fence is down now. Holy Come on. shit. I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. There's <clears throat> that cow over there. Let's get this. There's a like, cow in the background. Come, Mark, let's go. Push. Push. Holy fuck! What just shit. happened? Fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Oh shit, Mark! What the? Get to the gate, Mark! Get down, you asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the huh? fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With a fence on, that gate is our only way out. You fuck with us. Yeah, we'll take what we want. Uh. Behind the tractor. Quick, we'll see you. Oh uh, shit. Ah, it's near me to We had a deal. Get out of the open. What about all our okay. food? Okay. Anything else I need? The good. Now we're gonna take what's ours. Uh. Over there. Can I need it. I got one of you. No. There's something stopping it. Is this thing here? This thing? Lee, get back here. Oh, okay, maybe not. There's a thing back here, I believe. The blades are stuck in the dirt. Get off. Did you really think you could fuck with us? Oh, it's moving. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Oh, shit, that hurts. I see you. We had an agreement. Mark, you better not fucking die, bro. You and Kenny the only thing keeping me alive. Oh, there's loads of them up there. What, what happened? Oh, shit. Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. Gonna have to move it. How? Move it ass. Shit, Mark, let's go, bro. One, two, 
Oh, and there's another one. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? You assholes deserve to die! Shut the fuck up, bitch. Did you really think you'd fuck with us? I don't know who you are. Oh, he's alive. Oh, oh. Uh, uh, oh, no. kick him. Kick him. And again. Uh. Give us the food. Oh, okay, that works. You okay? Are you okay? Yeah. Barely. Come on. Do this. The no. gate's right there. Uh. Uh, the, uh, the zombie is following. Oh, nice. Let's get out of here. You don't get closer. Who the fuck is that? Butter. You told us you turned the fence off. Fetch came on, we got damn I thought this place was safe. The fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. <laughs> hey y'all. Mark. Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It isn't as safe as we thought. It was a fluke so much. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Oh, everyone's gonna Bandits, fucking die. Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. No. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, <laughs> that's... Real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Okay. So Carly has the big boy gun, hey, uh, and she's staying at the fucking motor home. Group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? Oh, that's I what love I was going to do. You Just bastard. like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. God damn it, that's what I wanted to do for her. Fuck you. <laughs> Go to this thing. I wonder if he's gonna get pissed if I try and open it. Oh no, you don't mind, okay. Chickens? Ooh. Actually I don't wanna go over there. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. It's a lot of feed for a cow. Some more feed. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work. Oh, he's him in the background pushing him. Oh, that becomes a problem. The 
if there's not enough room in the house for all of us. I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Nothing. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. God damn it, I want to go inside. Ooh. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're going to need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mm. Oh. Sup, Larry Dickhead? Wait. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. Well, no, obviously not. Fuck you, Lily. Fuck you, Larry. I'm out here. Why is it lagging so much? Hey, oh. They look happy. Yeah. Sup, lads. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. <laughs> Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Mmm. I don't know. Oh, my game sound has just died. Where am I going? There you go. Uh, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Here. Oh shit, you found it? This cannot end well. Oh, sneak up. Okay, fair. I was just saying, like, is he gonna go? Is he not gonna go? Shit. You see anybody? Stay on your guard. He did. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Please tell me there's just two people fucking in there, that'd be so funny. You know, they're just getting some private time. Smell good? There's no one. Clear. This camp's too small, it can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Let's have a look, see. Got some milk. Nothing. Oh, never mind. Nothing. Empty. Why, why, why did you move that? <laughs> Ooh, boxes. More stuffs. 
What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Machine need empty cans. Too much for one person. This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Ooh. Take John's. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Oh. A thing. What do you find? Camera. A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Hmm. Ah, she is very useful. Shopping cart. Mm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. <laughs> Ooh, gas. Nothing but fumes. Shit. I mean, something's better than nothing, I guess. Kettle. Still hot. Just water. Well, just water can be enough. A lawn chair. Looks like they expected to be here a while. It's a little girl. That's got a thing in it. Oh, Clementine's hat. Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. Ain't Where's going this? back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Huh? Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. Huh? You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. Not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Oh. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I faked them every way I could think. Oh, no. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed him. Oh. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another. She'll come back. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Uh, Take what they want and then destroy it all. Screw this Take shit. a can of beans. Take a little you girl. Shot it's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. Huh? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Bruh. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for. Oh, oh fuck.
But uh, there was no need for that. God damn it! You murdered that woman, you're gonna shoot him at yourself. Thanks, well, I guess. Thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. Aww. You shot her. <sighs> you it's shot a clean the woman. shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. For a woman? So, that's bullet? it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. I wonder if there's a way to save her. Dane Crossbow? Come on. We got Clementine's hat though, yeah? I hope. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. Uh, what happened? Handled it, Mama. Well, sort of. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then. Why don't you? Oh, well, calm down, Princess. I'll do it myself. Huh? What's going on over there? What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Uh, yeah, you could say that. <laughs> yeah, you could say that. We don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. She's hey, delusional. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Mm. I have a feeling this ain't going to be what I think it is. Oh, we can go give her a hat. Oh, you... Why'd you close the door on me? I got your hat. Right, we got a camera. Ooh. Danny. Hello. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that gun. This place I swear. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Uh not much I guess. It's just gun. It's kinda creepy as well. Not much, I guess. Exactly. Please tell me he isn't gonna fuck the gun. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Mm. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Oh, he gives me the creeps. Oh, I didn't notice it before, but he gives me the fucking creeps. Ooh, toolbox. Anything in here? What might be useful? Mm. Multi tool. Just gonna borrow this for a second. We just gonna nab that and not say anything. Sweet. I like how boozy you are, my friend. Do, 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 do. Uh, I don't think now I have batteries. I don't think now I have batteries. We need to go in there. No, we can't go over there. That's fine. We shall go into the barn. Yo, Clementine. 
clam. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. Are you sure? It's okay. Go ahead. Dom. No. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. Wait, what? What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Salty. Did you lick it? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Did you lick it or not, you weirdo? Let me go out back there. Let's open all these doors. Oh. Ooh, dairy. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Empty. Hmm. That's, uh... Looking for a battery. Oh, more stuffs. Ooh, looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Ah, it's probably where they keep that shit. Pretty see if I can go out back there in a minute. This one, pretty empty. It's a feeding trough. Well, yeah, I noticed that, bro. Let's go this side. See if there's anything here. All I'm looking for is a barrel. Uh, a barrel? A battery. Oh, playing the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. <laughs> okay. Oh, he looks so sad. Stupid kid. Looking for a battery. Do, 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 nothing in here. Check the other door. Some more, yeah, I was going to say, is there one more? Oh, look. What? Just some fence posts. Goddamn. No battery. I go back here. He might tell me off for trying to open the door, I don't know. Yeah, it's got a padlock. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Uh, she's not actually family. Stop being stupid. You're being stupid. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya. What's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Oh, no. Screw, screw, screw. Uh, I'm not gonna take the lock apart. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... You know, urban? <laughs> oh, you are not saying what I think you Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. He's from Florida. The excuse was he's from Florida, bro. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the bad uh, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. Oh, all right. that's funny. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. <laughs> Can I help you boys find something? What's behind What's the door? What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. 
We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Okay. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, Mama gets nervous. Andrew, mm. I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Mm, that was a little bit sus. I need a screwdriver, bro. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. All right, let's, let's go. Oh, hello. Dude. Clementine, take your hat. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yep. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Well, yes. Yeah. Did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? Uh. I'd like to someday. I don't think so. I haven't thought about it in a while. I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Oh. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Hell yeah. Uh, but you go on ahead. God damn it. I want to pet the cow with her. How could you? She looks skinny. Hey there, Andy. Yeah? Where'd you keep your tools? So, where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Oh. Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while and raid our stuff. Even with the fence. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Don't touch that door now, bro. Go, Kenny, 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 go, 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 Kenny. Kenny, quick, touch the door. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Fuck. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Oh. Fuck. Hey <sighs> there, Andy. Yeah. Ah. <sighs> All righty then. Dag damn it. Guess we're never gonna find out what happened with that fucking door. Oh, you just closed the door. <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage. Oh this no, party. I don't want to watch this. To help out. I couldn't do it without. Him. He's got charm coming out of his ass, as he said. Oh yeah, I've got camera still. I need a battery. I still need a battery for this video camera. Ooh, huge generator. Turn it off. Oh. There you go. Oh, I don't wait. I don't wait. I can just turn it off. Can I leave? Can I take the belt? <clears throat> that thing is all too tight for my bare hands. Oh, I want to back out and just leave. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Okay. Gas cans? They're storing gasoline all over the property. I need to shoot one of them, they just fucking explode. Yes. I don't really do anything here. I need a single battery. Also, it sounds like it's about to fucking thunder it down. Fine, we'll cut the thingy. It's 
so slow. There we go. Fine. Power switch. Boop. Boop. There, that should do it. Quick, run away. Him, friend. Can I talk to him? No. <laughs> Quickly. Don't look suspicious. Don't look suspicious. Don't look suspicious. Don't look suspicious. <laughs> yep. Let's go in. Loading screen. Yeah. Oh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Kenny, come on quickly. Go. K Kenny, move your ass. Mom, Dad, dinner time. It's dinner time. Okay, honey, Shit. let's get that. Dad, Dad, come on. Let's eat. Bro, he's Kenny, hungry. come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Yes, sir. I like Kenny and all, but this shit is stupid. Oh, no. Uh. One. Two. Three. Four. I don't want to break the actual lock because that looks suspicious. Is that a face I could see? What? What the Boy, fuck? Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Oh, shit. Dinner time. What the hell is this? It's, why is this so much? I found this door open like this. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but... Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Yeah. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, that cat. Oh, it matters to me. Okay, that's fair. We're just not going to talk about it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you, bro. I honestly thought they were cannibals as soon as you opened that. Biscuits? You wow. are an angel. Biscuits? Oh, Excuse boy. Us. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Go. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. Where's I can Mark? eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Where's Mark? Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. I'm gonna go check on Mark. I don't think he's alive. Oh, they're so cannibals. Oh, why do I always have to be fucking right? Fuck that, I'm going upstairs. Move! We need to go and check on Mark. Ah! Quickly now, bro. Gotta find Mark. Marky Moo, please be alive. Don't be dead. Bedroom door? Closet? I assume that's a generator. Battery. Battery. Power cord, medical supplies. Candles, morph morphine. What do they need so much morphine for? Candles. Smart. Mm. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? 
I don't want to touch the power cord because it's going to turn something on downstairs. Mark. Stains. Mark. Shelf. Is that blood? Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Mark. Oh, this is like a secret room, ain't it? Oh no, Mark's gonna be chopped up. I swear to God. What huh? the hell? Mark. Mark. I swear to God, if you kill Mark off, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. There's a light underneath it. I fucking knew it. Another door. Hello? Uh oh. Uh, Mark? Lee. Mark? What the hell happened? to your legs, man. Don't eat dinner. <laughs> oh, shit. Clementine. Oh, shit. Uh, do you come time before she eats? Clementine. Don't eat the food. Time. No! Huh? Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Duck, oh. Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He Duck. He just got a dog. He can use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Ridiculous. Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Guys, don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Uh, you're Dad, taking... I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. Uh oh. I didn't get. I, I didn't get to read the other choices. I was too slow. It was very quick. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Shit. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Oh. Like y'all. Oh. Can he get your gun? Come time, run. Did he grab Lily, a knife? Lily, grab a knife! Nobody's going anywhere! Oh, shit. We got lots of use for y'all right here. Oh, fuck. Maybe grab a knife wasn't what a good idea. Fucking Put your fuck? guns down! We're walking out of here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! Lee? Lee? Clementine? Santa? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Let go of Clementine, I will kill you. I'll kill you! Clement, uh, you fucking touch a hair. Oh, what the fuck's that? Is that. Is it Mark with no legs? Please. Someone. Ah. 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 Oh fuck! Come time, don't look, honey, don't look. Open the goddamn door! What? You can't keep us in here. 
Open up! I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bang. bare hand! We gotta find another way out of here! Oh. Yo, shit! Uh. Fucking bastards! What the fuck's going on? Open oh, this door! God damn it! I will knock the we goddamn door stopped. down! Hello. It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. Oh, I know. You didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay? What happened? What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, nice. we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! That's one thing we. Oh, this he's gonna have a heart attack. This goddamn sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. <laughs> you're, you're worse than the walkers. Dad, she... please. Mm. Please settle down. I'll, I'll rip your goddamn heads off. Should I just go in and make you swallow them? Could there be a hole behind these pallets? Probably not. Nope. No such luck. Come on, try yourself. Are you okay? Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! There's more of us on the way. Salt Let licks. Us out now, if you want to live. That is not <sighs> gonna help. I'll, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, <laughs> easy. <sighs> Heart attack. Man's having a heart attack. He's dying. No. Dad, come on. Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. Not yet. You know what has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off <laughs> dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back, Lee. Oh, fuck's sake. Later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead. I have to at least try. We can't kill him if he's not dead. Uh, I can still save him. Maybe you're right. Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. That man is dead. You both know what happens next. We're trying. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Got to destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You got to have my back this time. Oh, I'm sorry, Kenny. God I can't damn it, just Lee. kill him. I need you. Please help me. Oh, don't make me choose between them. Um, Come on. Uh, Wake up. I don't want to. Wake up. Ah, uh, no. I'm sorry. Let's get you this over. You fucking monsters. Both of you. I don't want to see. I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> get off me. Don't do this. Oh, uh, no. No, no, no. Let go of me. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lily. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. no. Oh, he's getting a cow lick. Oh, shit. No! Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, he could have. I don't. Oh. I'm sorry. I don't know. you fucking touch me! <laughs> Clementine. <laughs> you okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. He was dying. He was dead. We couldn't take that chance. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? Yes. That's right. <laughs> oh, man. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. I'm so Think sorry, Lily. Something else, something hopeful. I can't go against my what? man, Kenny. What? You're walking talking. Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. 
Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. Oh. We're gonna get out, right? Yeah. You found a way out? Of course. I'm working on it. Of course I'll find a way out. Oh man. He's not gonna talk to me, is she? Sorry, Larry. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. <sighs> oh, I am so sorry. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. I still got it. Of course they took it. Shit. Right. Maybe there's something else we could use. Cowlick. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. Hmm. Can't do it's it, my fingers. Off that way. Hmm. Need a coin or something. Okay. Lily? Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. Larry would have wanted- Fuck you! You think he wanted this? Of course not. You but... don't know what he wanted. You never knew him. You never gave him a chance. Maybe not. He... Maybe, maybe I should have tried hard. But I know he loved you. He didn't give me a chance, bro. He'd want you to get out of here. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver or a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. <laughs> he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here. Do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Yeah. Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. <laughs> Fuck Larry, he was a dickhead anyway. He's gonna die of a heart attack. Oh boy. Oh lord, that's all. Any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? <laughs> you fucking vulture! Shut up. You'd do the fucking same if it was me. Plus, as Larry was a dickhead anyway. Such a back pocket? Huh. He still carried his wallet. That's unfortunate. You should have just taken the wallet and oh, this might be useful to me now. Oh, I'm now Larry. The ring. My mother's. Oh, Don't shit. worry. I'm not taking it. Oh, I would have taken it. Pretty shit, you know. He's dead Here now. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. Nice. Free monies. We killed and robbed an old dude. Woo! -hoo. What a successful day. <laughs> Just gotta remove these screws and get this Larry. unit off. In all serious note, I shouldn't have had to pick between them. I wasn't gonna fucking. Uh, if he lit, oh, I don't know. I don't think he would have fucking lived. He had heart condition and they didn't have any of the pills. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. I honestly don't think he would have lived. I'd be interested to see what the other outcome was. Well, there's our way out, Lee. Ooh. One at a time. It's too small to fit through. Don't know where it leads. Coming high. We don't know where it leads. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I can find out. You, you want to go out there? You don't have to do this. But you can do this. You know, you'd be brave. You know, you don't have to do this, right? I know. I just want to go home. This will help us get back home. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it.
No, she did it. Are you okay? Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Oh? Let me. Gotta go. Leave me alone. Lee, I can see him. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. But I shut the fuck up. Here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Good girl, Clem. At least you are smart about this. <laughs> Some people, man. Oh. We're back here. Nice. Oh, that's going to be Mark, ain't it? Oh, okay, Mark's not there. Mark's already fucked. He has no legs. A hook? Nice. Ooh. Mini cow prod? Oh, a taser. Nice. Taser's always good. Oh. Oh, I get to choose. Oh, fuck. I'll take the taser. Taser will be quieter. Is it Andy? Can, can we go? I have to speak to Kenny. So what's the plan? That tell Mass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. I got a taser. Okay. You ready? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. I got a taser for his ass. Oh. Dun. 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 Hey, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh, shit. Just guarding the place, like you said. Oh, sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Ha! Huh? Not the kid. And the meat on the tray. Oh, I know, Mabel. This is Lee, my favorite focus. Part Where's too. Danny? When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Oh. What's he doing? Uh oh. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. Damn it, Lee. This is not the time to freeze up. We keep it simple. Oh, I clicked on... Oh, uh, but... Show him from See what he's doing now. I... Ah! Grab the gun. Taze him. How the fuck did that not work, bro? Uh-oh. Oh, Ken oh my god, Kenny. Where's my family, asshole? You can't have them. We need the vet. No! Cat! Lee, come on! Just go. I won't be far behind. Uh-oh. We gotta kill him? Hell yeah. You see? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. What? Get part of yourself so others can live. Why you kill that That's woman? That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, me. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. Oh. You ain't gonna kill me. 
Just like he didn't kill. Fuck you. <laughs> oh fuck. Clementine, I'm sorry you had to see that. Fuck. Oh, Clementine, I'm sorry. God, no! Gotcha! Just go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Oh, I'm sorry, Clem, you have to witness that. So I have to be a bad guy sometimes. I can't let everyone live, can I? You know, frames are optional sometimes. Oh, my frames. Kenny! Oh, he's Kenny. Oh, that's not good. Maybe I should have taken the sickle. Oh, that's a walker. Oh, Carly. Carly. Lee? Ow. Shh. Ben. Is Hello, guys. Okay? No. We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us, Gal, up here. They attacked us. I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? In the Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Nice. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. Are oh, you not gonna get me out? Okay, fair. Fine, I guess you're a better shot than me anyway. Uh, uh, oh, great, we've got coins. That's going to help us. Oh, I'm going to take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Settle down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Yeah, it's me. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, she... Lee, hit back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around, didn't ya? Go, Brenda! Can I go in? Lee! Lee, don't you take another step! Brenda, come on now, you know you don't want to do this! Just go away and leave us be! What do I do in this situation? Do I back off? Stop right oh. there! I mean it! Oh, no. No. Oh. I told you to stop! I told you! What the fuck? The fuck? How did I die? I didn't do anything! They told me to stay still, so I did! Go, Brenda! I have to wait for her to go upstairs, son. Hi. Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Uh, I am really. I don't really anything I can do. Yo, Kenny, where you at, bro? I like to like move through. There's nothing for me to do. We're standing, you know, staring at each other. Is Kenny going to come down the stairs? I meant to do it when you're not looking at something. What do you want from me, game? Hey.
We're down. Fuck. I don't know what this game wants from me. I'm, I'm moving forward slowly. Stop ah! right there! I mean it! Uh. Okay, I'm staying still. Think about what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. Ah, uh, Killer Lee! All Just right. let me go. Oh, there's a walker there. Stay back! Okay. Don't do anything stupid! I. Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. We got a step. Go on. Please. I'll do it! Please! When you gonna me? I don't wanna yep. kill you, Lee! I'm I'm a friend. Please don't make this any worse. Just right. stop! I'm on mark, you can do good. I'm mark. Maybe a walker now. Yes, perfect. Great. This is dark. Where's Teddy? I said, don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurt him. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Let him go, goddammit. Ah. Shit. That ain't gonna happen. And don't get up. Oh shit. <sighs> Kenny. And who the fuck do you people think you are? Huh? Look at what you've done. Look what you've done. Calm down. Calm down? What for, huh? All we wanted was some goddamn gasoline. Oh, Carly, you fucked up, bro. Hell yeah. Uh, Q. Everyone's gonna live apart from Larry. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm not. Damn. Uh oh. Get up. Get the fuck up. But uh. Oh shit. Fuck. Someone shoot this bitch already. I can only press Q for so long. No. I'm pressing it! Uh, 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 <laughs> Lily, help! Lily, shoot him! What are you doing? Uh, uh, oh my god. Beat the Evelyn. Fuck out of here. Uh oh. Now nah, I'm done. I'm done. I'm not punching him anymore. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't. Shit. I ain't being a bad guy it's again. It's over! Fuck you! As soon as Dan and Mama get out here, you're, you're all fucked! They're already dead, bro. I said, it's over! Just walk away! Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! I'm not doing this, bro. Get back here and finish this, Lee! I'm not doing it. I'm not finishing you. You're a good man. Walk away. Clementine's already Get seen enough. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! 
Clementine has seen enough today, bro. Uh oh. They're getting in. Let's go. Oh, his mom's coming as well. That's funny. Damn. That was an episode and a half, and we're still going. Holy shit. Mm, Clementine. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. That's nah, fine. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? Yep. For food? Yep. I witnessed it myself. Yeah. Yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. But... I stopped her. Yeah. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. Hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She oh. said it was with your stuff. Ah, oh, camera. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Hmm. How's Kenny uh. being out? How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Mm. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. Oh no, he's dying, ain't he? He's not gonna make it. Don't do this to me, Kenny. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Oh, no. I'm with you. We fucked up, it'll be fine. I'm, I'm with, with you. you. Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Clementine. Stay oh close. no! It's gonna make us leave Lily at the motel. Did you have to kill those men. I only killed one. Yeah, they were bad. I'm sorry you saw that. You shouldn't have done that. Yes, they were bad men, Clementine. They killed Mark, and they were gonna kill all of us. They had to be stopped. Understand? Yes, I think so. Hey, uh, Dad, what's that noise? Oh, no. Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. <laughs> what is that sound? Someone at the motel? Has Glenn come back to save us? What the fuck? The fuck is this shit, bro? Hello? Come on, I'll shoot. Don't shoot, we're here to help. Hello? Hello? Approach the car slowly. Uh huh. I don't see no one. Hello? There's no one here. What the fuck? Figures. Oh, oh crap. Empty. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. Oh. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? 
Uh, we should, we should have, we have to take this clam. You're right. You're right. Should. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. We can't. I don't want any part of it. We'll survive without it. We've done enough damage already. We've done enough damage already. What do you mean by that? Come on, Kenny. Between this and the meat locker, you know what it means. Fine. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Fine, Kenny. Go for it. Okay. What have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Can I take Lee, the combat there's you? a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. No. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, oh, fuck. you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? <laughs> no. Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. I got something got loud. Making is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get oh, all that? Shit. We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. Oh, Lily's fuck. not doing so good, huh? But we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. <laughs> people out there got things lined up but better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Yes. Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Oh, fucking hell. A long road ahead. Shit. Uh, you, oh my god, you and 44% of players chose to cut off his leg. You and 61% of players had da Danny sh shoot her, oh fuck. You and 49% of players helped kill Larry. You and 61% of players didn't kill both brothers. You and 49% of players didn't steal. Wow. I mean, I only didn't because Clementine. The Walking Dead starved for help. That was a good little episode, you know. Oh, this is a long episode as well, man. Apparently. Oh. Jesus. Right, well, that's the end of this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. 
and the next episode should be out in the next couple of days after this one comes out hopefully um i am doing these like episode like i did think of chunking it out a bit but you know, like splitting into two but i'm just gonna leave it as a full episode you know there might be a few cuts here and there but that's about it really um depending on how long next the uh, next episode is it'll be it might be kind of two i don't know Anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode of the Walking Dead Telltale series. But yeah, I hope I hope you all enjoyed as much as I did, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.